Double up! Vas-y! Lovely boat, beautiful, right? So well, and uh, yeah. So we're gonna then, uh, just fish a little bit inshore. Uh, maybe try and catch a bunzi. Yeah, that's the plan. And on the first drift, Cameron made sure the guys already went tight on some really decent fish. Now these bundles of mussels is on the short list of every saltwater angler that aspires to pick a fight with these aggressive fighters. Forever looking angry with the world, these guys will make sure you get your money's worth. How's the fight thank you? Ah, uh, strong fish. Nice fight. Okay guys, so on with the fish here. Yeah? Should be a punzi. Double up, let's see. Nice, man. Hey, man. Just came out. Mm. Get out of the way, yeah. Let's see if I can grab it quickly. Yo, there we go. Not a monster, must be, I don't know. Cameron, uh, eight, eight kilos. Eight, ten kilos. Beautiful. Okay guys, we did one drift. Guys hooked a few cracker and then two landed, uh, one lost. Yeah, we're just doing another trip over the reef now. Um, yeah, lots of smaller fish around. You know, we want to catch them, obviously. So we got big hooks and big baits. Hey, Outmark? strong fish. Yeah, hey, thanks. Well done. Well done, boss. Thanks, man. Ah, that's it. You know, you know, in the game. Fast, baba. Fast, plus. Here we go, target species black cracker. This one must be about eight kilos, nine, somewhere there. We're gonna put him back. Just revive it. There we go, beautiful fish. Guys, very slow, slow growing reef fish. There we go. Go, 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 go. Oh, there we go. Nice. Thanks, Cameron. Thanks, Skip. Well done. Yeah, but I'm just saying while he's holding it. Got it. Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Wait, wait. Woo! Oh, 
so yeah he's right okay guys yeah yes the cracker are wild and so hot there we go oh jesus you must Woo! unbelievable it's something out of this world it's and, and it's it's shallow here so you can release them and they go back they live and you're not pulling them you know they're not blowing up and they're not uh, uh, floating up so it's oh, guys unbelievable it's un absolutely awesome to be here it's just I, I cannot explain it such an awesome experience so there we go on <laughs> No man! <laughs> Unbelievable! Finally. Finally. Let, it go, let 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 it go. No, no, no. Oh, so that's nice. Guys, please keep in mind that these are resident fish and very slow growers and should be respected accordingly. Rather release as many as you can to give another angler this awesome opportunity of battling one of these boys. Okay guys, so that's the end of our Punzi session. Uh, we, we got lots of punzis and we managed to release most of them. Uh, the one or two guys kept one or two fish for them to eat, the smaller punzis. Um, I got three uh, and uh, all three released. So I'm happy, tough that they all went back properly. Uh, no issues. It's quite shallow here, so uh, we're fishing at about, I don't know, 20, 30 meters deep. So they don't really... I mean, you can release them, you know, you don't have to take them. They're not gonna, not like the coppers where you're fishing so deep. So, so yeah, guys, it was awesome, awesome fishing off Cameron's boat here from Palmy. Uh, absolutely wonderful. If you haven't done it, come and do it. It's, it's just the best experience you can ever have uh, trying to catch this fish. Obviously, I'm not one to fish bottoms. I like to fish for pelagics, but uh, nevertheless, it's something that we don't get up uh, our coast so it was a good experience uh, yeah thank you it was lacquer thanks Cameron once again thank you very much for Bulls in and Cameron for accommodating the guys and taking them out on some really memorable experiences and Palmy is a place to visit and should be on every angler's list